everybody. My name is Lauren. I am the editor of Trembling with Fear for Horror Tree, and I am stepping into the breach for Stuart, who was going to be stepping into the breach for Belinda himself. Uh, Belinda is enjoying a fabulous vacation that we are all very, very jealous of. Um, but uh, Stuart is having a few tech issues, which is never great when you've got to record a YouTube video. So uh, you're stuck with me this week, um, and I am going to be sharing Stuart's calls for his favourite markets of the week. First up is Cursed Objects from Bloody Hatchet Press. They're going to be officially opening on the 1st of February and are closing on May 1st of this year. This one is paying a flat amount, 25 of your British pounds or roughly 30 US dollars according to today's currency rates. The name of the anthology says it all. They're looking for horror stories about objects that are cursed. It's pretty open as to what the curse is and how it plays out in the story. So you've got a lot of wiggle room here. Next up, uh, we're going to talk about a royalty paying market, which we know many authors are against. However, this is royalties for novels and novellas. Darklit Press is a newer outfit run by some of the biggest supporters of indie horror out there, and it's open for new work. While they aren't specifically asking for horror, they are looking for darker speculative fiction. So if it isn't horror, it should at least be adjacent to it. Third is the 2023 winter release of Fun Employment Quarterly. Uh, the idea here is to run science fiction and fantasy stories that deal with autonomy. So again, there is a lot of wiggle room. This one is another flat fee paying market with $20 Canadian, which at uh, this time is nearing 15 US dollars. It's a fun topic though, and with a focus on science fiction or fantasy, it has a lot of interesting areas to run with. Finally, we have Tea with Coffee Media's Living with Demons, which has stories due on March 12th this year. The theme on this one is going to be challenging. They want stories that give people with mental illness hope using metaphors. However, it also has to fall into the realm of dark fantasy. So think dark fantasy that has happy endings. While this is another flat paying market of $25, you'll also be getting two contributor copies for your bookshelf or giving away. I reckon I might check this one out for myself, actually. But we usually run with four markets, and this time we have a bonus one to share as well that went live today. We previewed it on the site last week, and we didn't want to call it out specifically as one of our own co-writers is co-editing it. This one is coming from Dragon Roost Press and is the potential first installment of the Novus Mostrum collection called The Midnight Zone. And I totally stuffed all of that up. I apologize to the editors. <laughs> the idea here is to deliver solid new stories with original monsters. The pay is three cents per word and a contributor's copy with a submission window running from the 1st of February to the 30th of March, 2023. It's being co-edited by Douglas Gwillem and our very own Ken McGregor. Apologies to Douglas and Ken for me absolutely destroying your names uh, of the Novus Monstrum collection. And that's it. Uh, this year has been starting off strong with a lot of really fun new topics for open calls. We hope that one of these is standing out for you and you've got a productive writing week ahead. One of the Horror Train team will catch you next week. Until then, bye for now and happy writing. Thank you.